So today I want to go over a video that I uploaded back in November titled Massive Weedy Shower Failure. So most of the comments that, that came into question had to do with the sealant that was used. And I want to reiterate that this shower was built in 2007. I included that in the description of the video. I mentioned it several times throughout the video. So there were different instructions and materials that Weedy was using at the time of this install in 2007, most notably the sealant that they used. So I got a bunch of comments about the sealant, that it was white, it was stretchy, it was a different type of sealant. That is, and so a lot of you said the installer used the wrong sealant. And so it was really difficult to find any information on what type of sealant Weedy was using back then because all it said in the instructions was a Weedy approved polyurethane caulking. So what that meant, I didn't know. I just knew it was polyurethane. And I know that's different. They use a different sealant now today. So I went back into archive.org and I'll show you how to do that. So, so all you have to do is go into Google, type in archive.org, It'll take you to this Wayback Machine, at least it does on, on my computer. I typed in weedy.de backslash USA. And what that did is it actually took me to all of the different captures or ar archives of the websites from different time periods. See, there's two, 2018. If I go back to 2007, I found this capture on August 24th, 2007. And so this actually took me to that archived website from 2007. If I go to the data sheets, I find Cicaflex 201 US. So this is the sealant that Weedy was using at the time, a polyurethane sealant. And you can see all of the different properties of it. Um, it does show it, that it comes in a white color. This is, this is the sealant that they were using. It's called Cicaflex 201. So once I found that out, I wanted to find out a little bit more about what Cicaflex 201 was. So now I just went back into Google and just typed in Cicaflex 201. And the website for Cicaflex came up. And it's a type 1-C polyurethane, which means it's a single component. And there it shows the white color. Now what surprised me on this is when I went down to the warranty, it said that the company warrants this product for one year from the date of installation. So basically, Weedy was putting a 15-year warranty, but they were using a component that only had a one-year warranty. Now, I don't know much about the industry and how this stuff works, but to me, it seems like they were using a component in their waterproofing assembly that wasn't going to live up to that 15-year warranty that Weedy was giving on this installation. So to find out a little bit more about um, polyurethane and its properties, how long it lasts, I just Googled how long does polyurethane caulk last. First thing that came up was something that said five to 10 years. So this led me to an article and they're actually using Cicaflex in, in this article, but it talks about uh, what polyurethane is. It's an organic, has, it is an organic material. Um, so it breaks down in UV light and water. And it says, typically you can expect a polyurethane sealant to last five to 10 years. Again, that is falling short of a 15 year warranty. So I just wanted to clear that up. I mean, everybody was asking about the saying, this wasn't weedy sealant. The, the installer did this wrong and that wrong and that wrong. And when I took this assembly apart, when I did the demo, I did notice that the sealant was really soft. And I noted that in the original video. So if you want to go back and watch that video, you can see how easily the sealant kind of comes apart. And it just seems like it had been breaking down. It didn't seem like the sealant was bonded real well and it's just delaminated real easy from uh, the, the weedy board. So for all intents and purposes and all the research that I did, I found that this sealant that they were using probably wasn't good enough for a 15 year warranty on a shower. So the last thing I did is I looked through the original instructional DVD that came with the kit back in 2007. The homeowner had kept this as part of his records, so he sent the file to me. I was able to look through it and go over it. 
and see if everything kind of matched up to what all you had left in the comments about how it was supposed to be installed. Another one of the, the comments that I got was that, that while he put the sealant into the rabbit joint and pushed the board down into it, he didn't use an adequate overlap on top of it. So you put enough sealant on the outside and spread it out. I think a lot of the comments said you had to spread out two inches from either side. Now, if you note in the instructional DVD, when they're putting that in there, he doesn't do that either. And it looks like it only, and you can see right there in the picture, it's, it's not going out two inches. He basically just took his putty knife and knocked it down. So there you have it. Take it for what it's worth. This video was just to give you guys some information that I found out about what it took in 2007 to install a weedy shower and what the what materials they used and I thought you guys uh, would be interested to know that. So, so anyways, I hope you liked the video. Leave your comments in the section below. Let's keep learning together so that we can get to know these products better and be able to make educated decisions on when we're going to use a certain product or not use a certain product. So. So leave your comments in the section below. Make sure you click like and subscribe and turn your notifications on. If you haven't noticed, a lot of my videos don't show up on your home feed unless they're a certain type of video. So if you wanna see all my videos, including ones like these that might not be that popular, make sure to turn your notifications on and you'll see all my videos. I, I upload a video once a week, so if you're not getting a video once a week and you want to, go ahead and hit that notification bell. So have a great day, and I love you, and I love being your tile coach. We'll see you on the next video.